Hello, welcome back to the HVAC Budget Channel. Tonight we are going to be looking at the SOG Power Access multi-tool. And I have to say, I am very impressed with this multi-tool. Let's get started. All right, so one of the first things we'll notice about this tool is that it has a really nice pocket clip. And that has become increasingly important to me, especially if you notice the size is very fairly similar to that of the Leatherman Bond. So we'll see that the length is about the same. This will be around 4.1 inches long. And then we notice that the width is really, really close as well to the Leatherman Bond. Now, as we open this up, we notice the next uh, thing that this offers is a really nice set of pliers. Now, I've really come to appreciate SOG's pliers. It has one of the best pliers on the market right now, smoothest opening. And to me, the pliers operate just as smooth as a Victorinox or the Leatherman P2, but at a much cheaper price. And I really have come to love SOG's pliers. Now, on the outside of this plate here, you'll notice that we have a protractor. And if you line this line right here up, you'll notice that we can get to the 45, 80, and 180 degree angle. On this side, it's the 90, 60, and 180 degree angle. So that is pretty neat that SOG offers that option, just a little bit extra touch. And I find myself really enjoying those extra pieces of engineering. With the pliers, we'll find that these go to a fairly precise needle point edge here, ne these needle nose pliers. Uh, they come together very well, and then they're very precise there at the end. Now, some people may find them almost too much precise, but they seem to be very nice. Then we've got the wire cutters. And then what I really like down here is the wire crimpers. These jaws down here um, are part of the wire crimpers. Now, SOG has a pretty storied history with electrician multi-tools, their Paladin line, the, what is it, 510, 525, 540, something like that. There are several multi-tools that were to be used by um, people who were in communication and so forth. And those go for a pretty penny right now on eBay. All right, so SOG Power Access so far has impressed me. We have all these tools here, then we go ahead and we come to the end. Now this is one of its best features I have found so far. With, uh, on the end here rather, we have the bit driver and you'll find that it's magnetic and then it closes in place so you can use this Phillips. I have used this actually today to install some shelving for my wife. And I was really cranking down on this Phillips, and I can say firsthand, this is an excellent design, at least in my multi-tool. I have to say that it's in the center of the multi-tool. It is one of the best quarter-inch bit drivers I have used, actually. So I am extremely impressed with this multi-tool. On the outside, again, we have several tools that can be flicked open, almost like the Leatherman P2. And we have the three-sided file, rather. And of course, it has a fine and coarse on the file. We also have a screwdriver, more of a medium flat-edge screwdriver with the can opener. Then we have the Phillips. Now, this one swings out, so it's more of a uh, Phillips in the center of the multi-tool, which I thought that was unique. And then we have the can opener with the more micro screwdriver there on the end. We do also have the lanyard hook. And before I forget, there is an inch and a centimeter ruler here. I do not find myself using that very much, but just so you know, that is included as well. On the other side, we find there is a knife. Now, for some people, again, this may be a little bit too small of a knife, but I find it does a really good job for what I need it to do. Again, I would consider this more of a medium multi-tool, but I, again, like I said, have been very impressed with it so far. On this side, we also notice we've got this micro driver. This will be more like your eyeglass, uh, very more of a eyeglass thermostat driver. 
And then we have the awl with the eye here as well as your large screwdriver. And I use this as well, more like a pry bar. You do have to be careful. I have to say this is not a Leatherman 300. This is not a Surge, but I, again, just for its weight at 5.9 ounces, I've been really impressed with this multi-tool. Now this will be 5CR metal, I believe is what they advertise this as, 15 MOV, something like that. Um, and so SOG right away just tells you up front on its website, this isn't the best metal out there. But again, I feel like it is a really nice package. Now you can get the deluxe version of the SOG Access. It has some longer tools, a couple more blades to it. But this version right here, just the standard version from what I can find, is going for around $54. It's marked down from $65, going for around $54 right now on Amazon. I, again, very impressed with this tool, love this tool, very happy to have acquired it, and I think it's an excellent multi-tool for EDC carry. All right, I hope you've enjoyed this multi-tool. Make sure to like, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.